Hi guys, Steve here, and on this video I'm going to show you how to solo tame a Quetzal. But before we get to it, I'm going to save you some time by going through other methods that people suggest that either don't work, are out of date, or just bullshit. This way, you won't waste hours trying them beforehand, because you know they won't work. Okay first, holding a scorpion with an argent bird and trying to sting it. This was suggested back in 2015. It was a nightmare to do it at that time, but now the scorpion's been nerfed, and only has about a quarter of the damage it did then. You've got no chance. The scorpion can't do enough damage to get the Quetzal's torpor up. It'll fly to 50-50 where it'll get stuck and you'll drop the scorpion. The Quetzal will get shot through the bugged wormhole, that's what's caused this one's damage. And then, after many hours, the Quetzal will just despawn. To your utter disbelief. What the? <laughs> it despawned. Oh my god, I've been at it for hours. Method 2. Landing on the Quetzal's back and clubbing it unconscious. Before this was patched, if you tried about a thousand times, you might be able to land on its back once. And when you did manage it, when you dismounted, you'd just fall off the side of it. However, you can't do it anymore, as you'll just keep sliding off. Method 3. Fly above it, parachute off, and shoot it on the way down. Yeah, good luck with this. It's hard to hit it at a distance, and the darts seem to have a shorter range. That may or may not be true, but the biggest problem is, when you do manage to hit it, it flies off and leaves you floating there. If you're lucky it might fly back to you, but more than likely it's going to fly off out of range. Then, by the time you get to the ground, you've probably lost where it's gone. And as you can see, without being able to use a scope, it's really hard to hit it. So you're going to waste a hell of a lot of narco darts trying to down it. If you're very lucky, you might be able to hit it two or three times before it flies away. But you're going to have to repeat this process over and over again. I tried getting back onto my pterodon to fly after the Quetzal, but it's out of range. So I'm just going to have to wait and float down. Method 4. Fly up to the Quetzal and grappling hook it. Then when you're attached, shoot it with narco arrows or darts. But what I didn't know is that as soon as you attack it, the line breaks. And on that death, I lost all my best stuff and a hundred Rex kibble. Ouch. Method 5. Jump off your bird and grappling hook it. Then start shooting a Quetzal. You can hover in the same spot, but again, as soon as you start attacking a Quetzal, it'll fly off. And you're left with a problem with it being too far away again. However, with this method, you have more control. Switch back to your crossbow and reel yourself in again. Then when you're close enough to the bird, mount it and fly after the Quetzal. Every time I go up in the grappling hook I've got to land, so you can reset the grappling hook. And that's a downside. But from this, we get to method 6. Fly to the Quetzal. Uh, make a uh, whistle with your bird to attack the Quetzal and before he, he, when he got close, Whistle passive again. So jump off and grapple hook your bird, then start shooting the Quetzal. You don't have to get on the bird and go near again. But this time get your spyglass out, look at the Quetzal, then whistle attack. That will make your bird fly to the Quetzal and start attacking it. But before it gets there, you want to whistle passive so it doesn't attack. You want to get as close as you can, but it'll take a bit of practice to judge the distance correctly. And it helps if you get the right keys sorted before you start this. 
Thank you. I'd advise pressing Is the it? passive button twice. Yes, thank you. Because sometimes your bird will attack, even though you've pressed it once. After you've whistled for your bird to attack, switch to your rifle and reload it. Then by the time you get there, you're ready to fire. <laughs> you just shot me! <laughs> oh my god! Nice shot, dude. <laughs> nice shot! Uh, did I shoot you over, bird? Oh, and find the lowest level Quetzal you can, as as soon as you got the first one, it's easier to get the higher ones later on. Keep shooting and chasing it, and you'll gradually wear it down. Try and shoot it in the head if you can, as it's more effective. Whistle for your bird to attack it again. Then finally, all your hard work will pay off. Oh, I've got it! Down. Oh my god, that's epic! He's down. And we are at 50 50. Next, reel yourself in and go down and start taming it. And after all those tries, that's the first Quetzal I've managed to down completely by myself. Down uh, the, uh, this side of the river. Leave <laughs> that away! <laughs> oh, go! Oh, we'll get... Uh, we'll get it! <laughs> ah! I'm getting scorpion and raptured! <laughs> Come here, you little git. All you need to do now is keep the Quetzal unconscious and give it food, preferably kibble, that you can learn how to make here. Get off my Quetzal! You bastard! On my next video I'll be showing you how to tame a Quetzal with a tribe member, which is a lot easier. Oh. That scorpion's trying to come back. Well, that's it guys. Thanks for watching, and if this has been helpful, please like and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the links of other helpful videos at the end, and hopefully I'll see you again. Goodbye.